podcast. Good afternoon. My name is Eric Sands from the Sands Firm PC. And today I want to talk about landlord tenant issues. And landlord tenant issues is probably one of the most litigated things in the city of New York. Um, you have to remember you have certain rights that you have statutory rights as well as common law rights. Just some quick tips about landlord tenant disputes. You have to remember if you are dissatisfied with the service your landlord is providing because he or she is not giving you hot water and things like that, which is incumbent upon you wanting to remain in the property. You just have to remember, you can't have a rent strike. You can have a rent strike if you want to, but you can't not pay the rent. You have to put the money in escrow. If you put it in escrow, and then you have to eventually pay the landlord when the repairs are made or how the dispute is going to be resolved. Just remember, you can't decide you're not going to pay the rent. And decide you're going to spend the money because then you will be in breach of the agreement. Another tip I want to give you about landlord tenant disputes is you have to remember that landlord tenant disputes, there's such a thing as called client enjoyment. That's built into every lease agreement, whether you have a lease or not. The other tip I want to give you is there's no such thing as a month to month in theory. If it's a residential apartment, you have a minimum one year lease that you're entitled to. You also have to remember your landlord has a right to make repairs. Some of the scrupulous landlords try to get cute around the law and they'll go into your apartment and enter and say, well, I had to make repairs. Unless an emergency such as a pipe broke and the water's flooding the apartment and, and a flooding apartment below there's a fire, the landlord has absolutely no right in your apartment. And what you can do is that that is a form of unlawful eviction when your landlord starts to enter and remain and actually uh, impede or impact your right to acquire an enjoyment. So just remember in New York, those are just a couple of tidbits of information that landlords do not belong in your apartment. They have to make an appointment. They have to call you up and then you can let them an appointment to make whatever repairs. But if they go in and out of your apartment without your authorization, then that's just another form of unlawful eviction and you have rights. And you have rights to serve in landlord tenant court either alone or you can hire an attorney. Thank you.